And the Griffins up with it now. A feed on left wing, got away from Bertuzzi, held in. Rampage working to the circle in front. They score on the doorstep. Great pass. Now Mantha takes a feed on right wing. Drop for Anthony CU. Back to Mantha with a great move down the slot. He goes a shot, save and the rebound. Big stop, another shot, score. Ryan Sproul. And it winds up at center where the Griffins have to clear the zone and play. Now Sproul for Bertuzzi at the line. Bertuzzi down that left wing. Stepped away from Everberg. Right in front of that, they walk in a chance and they score. Xavier Willette goes upstairs with it. But now 10 seconds to go in the five on three. Here's Nero in the high slot. Quick shot blocked by Marchenko. Now back across, they score. That one deflected. It came back to the right point, held in by Zach Redman. Former Fair State Bulldog, Zach Redman. He'll play the puck in the middle. Vigra takes a look. Near side, Colin Smith. Now Smith feeds it across. They walk in front of the net. Redmond's pass knocked uh, away, and they score from a terrible angle. Zach Redmond's going to get the goal. They're a good team. I mean, we, we had some battles against them last year, and it's just you know, we got to find uh, our hockey, and we got to stick to that for 60 minutes. And until we do that, it's going to be tough to get some wins. You had the power play opportunities early. Do you think it hurts you guys you know, that you had so many, and you only got one goal out of them? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, that's the time to take advantage of the team and, and get some momentum, and, and we didn't do that, so it, it's a little bit of a heartbreak for us, but it's going to happen a lot this year, so we just got to find ways to bounce back. Andy, Andy, what do you think you need to do to sit there and help out your guys' power play? Um, you know, I just I think it probably will start in practice. we got to start making good habits, and um, we, we got to play as a unit instead of individually, and... Um, if we continue to do that throughout the week prior to the games, I think we'll I think we'll be able to figure out what the talent that we have on this team. How comfortable is everyone with each other at this point? Um, I mean, now that we're 0-3, who knows? It's uh, you know people start gripping their sticks a little harder, but um, I mean, we I don't think our record shows for how we've been playing. We definitely have shown some signs of, of, of extremely good teams. So we'll just we'll hopefully start getting some bounces and we'll start putting some. Uh, points in the win column. I thought we played pretty well. We, uh, we had a lot of shots and uh, we've been playing like that lately. Obviously the first few games we've, uh, we've struggled in the scoring department, but I think we're getting a lot of shots and uh, we're going to find a way to put them in. Can you talk a little bit about the difference between how you played on the West Coast, both positively and negatively, and what you saw tonight? Oh, I think it's easier to play at home, obviously. You want to come in in a, in a home opening game, it's, it's fun and it's, it's awesome to be in GR and, and play here in front of these fans and going over there. It's uh, it's a lot different. The travel is, is a lot. Um, we're not really used to that. And uh, flying over there and then busing and then getting ready for a game, it's tough. So um, it's really nice to be back here and we'll get things rolling here. We have to start scoring some goals. We have two goals generated from our defensemen today. You know, our forward group, we're going to have to um, start generating something. And the thing is that uh, It'll happen. You know, I've seen this before, and uh, right now, you know, we just can't find the back of the net. What are some of the ways to try and solve that? Do you look at different power play matchups? You know, you yeah, you know, like uh, how a power play was alright tonight. Went, went two for eight. Uh, it was really a game of special teams tonight. Penalties on both sides. Uh, I thought our kill was pretty good, but uh, you know, the one goal that we did allow tied up the game and uh, gave them a bit of momentum. Um, but uh, once again, it's got to find, uh, we have to get guys going up front. And if it's juggling around the lines, then we'll have to do so. You know, I thought when we scored our first goal, it made it, made it brought us going a bit. The power play we made some adjustments during the game. Um, you know, but what it comes down to is puck, puck retrieval after a shot's made. We have to get those loose pucks, and that's just hard work. Mm -hmm. Coach, how did it feel knowing that 20 years ago, you know, you were, you were the, you know, First person to sit there and play for the Griffins being signed, then today you know you're the head coach. How does that, how does that feel today? Well, it doesn't feel too good right now, um, but it does. Uh, yeah, it's it, it's a special moment. We should get a had a, had a different result tonight, but uh, you know right now I'm just focused on tomorrow, trying to get this team moving in the right direction. You, you worry at all about the team pressing at all? You know, go one or three. You know and what? I've been so through this. Like, yeah, I've been through this before. In Oklahoma, I don't think. We had a winning record our first five games, and all of a sudden we're going to tear it, much like they did last year. You know, um, you know but we have to put the brakes on it here. We can't, uh, uh, you know, go like four, five, six games in a row. We, we have to put the brakes on it and get that winning feeling in here. And, and that's that's contagious. And uh, you know, we're we're right there. Uh, but the bottom line is, is that uh, 
and you have to have uh, you know certain guys that are counted on to provide offense to to, uh, to start providing offense, and uh, you know they will, they will. And it's you know they, they, I've seen teams go through this every year, and uh, unfortunately it's right now at the start of the year. We we just gotta do the little things right. We threw 41 shots on that. They're going to play well. You know, but we're going to face a, a good goalie again tomorrow night. So we're going to have to find a way to, to, to score some goals. If it's, it comes down to uh, getting greasy in front of the net, we have to do that.